Well, right now, hundreds of homebound seniors across Leon County depend on volunteers for food. The pandemic's changing the way those deliveries happen right now. But the people who drive dozens of miles every week are not letting COVID-19 stop them. They're doing what's right to help others manage the pressure of the pandemic in tonight's Rebound Tallahassee. The Rebound Tallahassee is sponsored by Perry and Young. Operations look a little different at elder care services in Tallahassee. I will say that at least 200 extra seniors are being served through Meals on Wheels right now. Nicole Ballas is director of fund development here. She says those extra seniors were added to their plate once the pandemic started. To get this food out to them, they've had to change the way they deliver. They used to deliver fresh meals daily, five days a week. Now they make frozen bulk deliveries that'll last the entire week, once a week. We just try to try to focus on the positive and, and ask and make sure they're, they, they, they're doing all right. Diane Jacobs is one of those volunteers. She's been helping her neighbors here since 2005. The pandemic has her going the extra mile to stay safe. You know, we're not going in the house anymore. There's, there's chatting at the door, but it's not as... It just doesn't feel quite as personal, but it's, you know, it's, it's going fine. The less frequent visits and limited contact have taken a toll. There's a lot more loneliness. But the center has made changes to their end, too, for that reason. We have staff members who transition from their normal roles over to phone calls. And as you saw there, workers and volunteers are wearing masks to protect themselves and the people they serve. Elder Care Services in Tallahassee serves about 2,000 seniors annually. They've got about 1,500 extra meals going out each week right now.